In this demo, you will see how to perform the following tasks. Let's begin by logging in to Confluence. To log into your Confluence Cloud account, you need to be a registered Atlassian user. In your browser URL, type https colon forward slash forward slash id dot atlassian dot com slash login, which brings you to the Atlassian login screen. Type your Atlassian email in the Enter Email text box and click Continue. Then type your password and click Login. This brings you to your Confluence Cloud homepage. If the Products page is displayed, select Confluence Cloud to access your account. Let's find out where you can check your permission settings. Features vary depending on the plan that you choose. When you change from Confluence Cloud Premium or Standard to Free, you'll no longer be able to set permissions and restrictions. For example, if you reset the space permission in your free plan, you will not be able to undo the action and will have to go back to a paid plan. On your home page, select the space for which you want to view the permission settings. Then select Space Settings. You can customize the overview page using the edit icon on the top right corner of the page. Select the permissions tab to view the permission settings. Depending on your user role and the plan that you are in, you should be able to modify these settings. Confluence is integrated to a number of Atlassian apps. Let's review how you can switch to a different app in Confluence. Switch to a different app. Click the Apps icon to switch to see the list of Atlassian apps displayed. Then select an app to switch to its home page. The next navigation task we're going to learn about is how to view the space sidebar. The Space Sidebar gives you access to the Space Overview, Pages, Blog Posts, Space Settings, and App Content. You can use the Toggle button to collapse or minimize the Space Sidebar and make more room to view content. Let's review the Overview section. The Overview option in Space provides you information created on that space. You can also customize your personal space by creating content of your choice. To make navigation easier, you can add personal shortcuts. Space shortcuts are personal shortcuts you add to space. Shortcuts are helpful or important pages you access often. To create a space shortcut, select Add Shortcut. You can link to pages in space, other related spaces, or relevant external web content, as well as reorder the shortcuts as needed. Now that we've covered a few common tasks, let's log off from your Confluence account. You can log off from Confluence at any time. Select your user profile and click Log Out. That brings us to the end of this video on finding content in Confluence. In this video, you learned how to log in and log off from Confluence, view permission settings, switch between apps, use the space sidebar, add personal shortcuts.